A Taiwanese woman has died of a rare brain infection caused by the Nagleria valerie, commonly known as the brain-eating amoeba. The woman, who was in her 30s, had visited an indoor water park in New Taipei. According to tests at the park, the pool water's chlorine concentration did not reach standards recommended by the Ministry of Health and Welfare. The park could face fines of up to 1.5 million NT if the amoeba is found in samples collected. We carried out tests on the water's chlorine content and found it was insufficient. Whether that led to the presence of the amoeba remains to be clarified by an investigation led by the central government. The amoeba can enter the respiratory tract from the mouth and nose and make its way to the brain, where it causes an inflammation. Once an infection happens, it is hard to diagnose because it's not something that we screen for in regular testing. There is also no consensus in treatment, as there are too few cases of this kind of infection. There is no established treatment. There are about 40 amoeba species under the genus Negleria. Only one of them, Negleria phalari, is pathogenic to humans. This amoeba can be found in freshwater bodies, hot springs, and pools with insufficient chlorination. It can also be found in water heaters and even soil. Initial symptoms of infection include headache, which later progresses to neck stiffness, seizures, loss of balance, and hallucinations. Its death rate is 99%, and even if cured, patients still may experience epilepsy and emotional disorders.